week 12 of the National Fade League is here. The Eagles are traveling to Cincinnati to take on the Bengals here. First and 10 for the Eagles here. And look at Carson Wentz. Gets his pretty much shitting his pants right here. And we chuck it. And look, look guys. Another interception. Another interception. It feels like it's the same thing. Common thing happening every game I show you guys. It's really upsetting. So second and I, Andy Dalton looking, by the way, all day in the pocket. All day in the pocket. All day. This man can have a seat. Can put a chair in that pocket. Watch a full season of Nargos. Breaking Bad. Fuller House. And throw a, and throw a pass. And he finds Tyler Effort right there. And we completely miss a hit stick. And just like that, the Bengals are up. Seven to nothing. I don't know what to do, man. I'm playing like a pleb. I'm playing like I don't want to win playoff games. I don't want to win games at all. I don't know what to do, man. But look at this beautiful play by Jordan Matthews. See, we, I'm liking that connection right now. I'm really liking the Wentz and Jordan Matthews connection. He's my number one. I really like that. I'm busy. Don't text me right there. But look at Zach Hurts. Just pretty much truck sticking people. This man's a beast. Third down and three. We, we're so close to the end zone, man. It is. It's just it's what we need to get. And we find DGB, and he absolutely gets destroyed. And we're going to kick a field goal here to make it three to seven. Because I'm not going to go for it. I'm not like that. No, I'll take my points when I need it. And look at Andy Dalton there just throwing needles, man. To AJ Green. He just throws them. Second and ten for the Bengals. By, once again, all by himself. And he gets demolished. By Fletcher Cox. Just a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful defensive play, man. Third and 13. They eventually don't get it. And look at Carson Wentz. Just uh, yeah, <laughs> don't know what to do, you know. I'm struggling. Third and seven. Wentz looking, looking. And I get stuck on Jason Peters' big ass. He gets a sack. I just, pff, I don't know what to do. Luckily, the Bengals go three and out. And now this is our opportunity to go all in and look at this. Finally, a, a flag that the Eagles can work on, man. This is another opportunity what we need to do. And that came at a perfect time for the Eagles. Second and goal. Hands off to the Ryan Matthews. And look at him. Just barely gets in the end zone. And hey, man, we got a ball game. We got a ball game here. 10 10 tied ball game. I'm feeling pretty good, man. Feeling really good. Now look at the Bengals here. Second and six. Oh, they're just gonna get a field goal. They gotta find their ways. And look at your boy, Brandon Graham, who's having a phenomenal, phenomenal season. Off the edge, man, coming in. Straight beasting. Third down and 14 for the Bengals here. They got a one minute and 30 seconds left. Look at it once again, all day in the pocket. He's going to find AJ. Oh, oh, good God. We almost killed AJ Green. That would have been pretty cool. Not, no, okay, not kill. Just just hurt. Bad. That, okay, I feel like it's a lot better. I don't want to kill AJ Green. He's a nice man. He's a great football player. It is what it is. But look right here. Darren Sproles on the return. He sees some green. He's looking. Look at the man go. Look at this spin move into five people. It's cool, though. We got time. Okay, we got some good field position we're going to work with. All we have to do is kick a field goal to win the game. Wentz looking. Look at this. We finally go to a check down. We finally get someone that last week, as you saw, I'm throwing hell Marys when all I need is one yard. I don't know what I'm doing here. You know, it just happened. So look right here. Play action psych that was Ryan Matthews. I totally forgot. I thought it was a play action. Sometimes when I, you know, go over and look at the commentaries or you know, look at the gameplay, I think, oh, play action. No, not it is. But look, we're gonna hand the ball to Ryan Matthews again. And we're kind of just like easing our way. You know, just easing our way. Try to milk the clock, get some yardage for an easy field goal for Sturgis, and look at Ryan Matthews goes. But this is what happens, man. Man. I was playing my niece and nephews. Alright. I had the game on rookie. So they can play and have fun. Now, when I play my franchise game, that still happens where everything is pre-made for them. So Ryan Matthews did a random ass spin move to make this. 
I blew it. When I could have just ran, could have had a touchdown to win the game. There, and that's what it is. And I completely, I blame my, my nephew, all right? I blame him. That's his fault, okay? Because, uh, yeah. <laughs> that was an easy dub, and I blew it, and we had to go to an OT. But look, but look at this. Carson Wentz gets sacked. I'm panicking now, okay? I'm thinking, oh no, did I just ruin a good a good game by playing with my niece and nephews? You know, they always I wanna play, but look at this! D G B for the victory. Finally, the Eagles get a dub. We struggling. We got something good, and luckily it was an overtime to make it more dramatic. Wentz to DGB. Oh, one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, it's pretty. Finally, we get a dub. The Eagles get a dub here. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy, Potsy. <laughs> we got that dub. I'm going to sip on my water real quick. Ah, peace.